Well, I'm holding the camera in my hand, and it's probably not the best way to do this, but I put the dog back on the base. Uh, I worked on it a bit today. I've decided not to make a DVD on the uh, creation of this dog because I want to do it where I plan it out instead of just half, you know, coming into it uh, and, and having a second thought about doing that. I think what I'll do is do a larger dog and do it as a uh, single uh, item uh, for a instructional DVD at some point in the future. So I don't think I want to make this one into an instructional DVD. As you can see, I have worked on the uh, ears a little bit and I've blocked in the body a little bit more. And I just added him back on the base just to see how it looks and I think it looks fine. It looks uh, like a dog uh, and it looks like the right size dog so I'm going to keep working on it and uh, I'll show you the video now that uh, I shot today and uh, I was just blocking in the body uh, using photographs that I have that I took off the web. Time to play with some clay. If you haven't noticed yet, I am not going into great detail on the muscles. I'm blocking them in and I'm using these wonderful uh, three-dimensional guides to help me. It's like having a uh, sculpture of a dog's anatomy right in front of me. But I'm not worried about every little muscle. Because quite honestly, it's all going to be covered with fur anyway. I just want to get the general shape. And then I'll come back and uh, get everything uh, blocked in. <coughs> these these uh, three-dimensional uh, 3D prints are just so helpful when it comes to uh, sculpting and like I said you can get them for free right off the internet it just takes a little searching and you'll find them
If you know the general anatomy of, like, say, oh, a horse or any four-legged animal, they're all basically the same. And, uh, of course, a dog is different, but, uh, but the general muscles are still there. What I do to make the ear, I just uh, make a cone and then I press my thumb into it, which uh, forces it to spread out. And then I just shape it. Of course, I'll come back and uh, adjust that. But... It's not quite where I want it, but it gives me an idea where the ears are going to go. I've been away from this for about a week now, and I'm just, I've been sick. I haven't been feeling all that good <sighs> and I'm not going to go into details there's nothing life-threatening or anything I just I just wasn't feeling a hundred percent all right that's going to be it for tonight give me a thumbs up and share my video and then check out my instructional DVDs uh, the link down below this video all right see you next time